Hi, I'm Dr. Joe Caffrey. I head up the Invasive Species Unit with Inland Fisheries Ireland. Uh, we're here on the banks of the River Barrow, uh, dealing with a high priority invasive riparian plant species. English name, Himalayan balsam. Latin name, Impatiens glandulifera. You'll see the plant behind me with people busily pulling it from the ground. Uh, this is a particularly aggressive species, uh, one that, when it establishes, creates very dense stands. You can see these behind me, beneath which our, in our native plants are unable to grow. Along the riparian zone or the riverbank edge, uh, it can cause bankside subsidence because when it dries back in winter, having killed the native species, there's nothing to bind the banks together. We're involved here today uh, in a pilot program to attempt to control or even eradicate Himalayan balsam from large sections of the barrow. This is a pilot program where we're using weaknesses in the plant's life cycle against itself. This is an annual plant. It has a very short life cycle. Uh, it appears in April and effectively is gone again in August. During that time, it will produce seeds. Each plant produces in the region of 2,500 seeds, which it can spread through explosive se seed heads up to five meters from the parent plant. Along the river's edge, the seeds are blasted into the river, travel downstream, are washed up onto the banks, furthering the spread of the plant. So, the plant is short-lived. The seeds last for one or at the maximum two years. So they are viable for at most two years. This is another weakness for an invasive species. And perhaps the weakness that's most useful to us is the fact that the plant has a very shallow and weak root system. Thereby, it is very easy to remove from the ground. Behind us here, we have some of our fishery staff and we have a group of volunteers from volunteer services and we're attempting to remove a large acreage of Himalayan balsam. The method being applied is simply pulling the plant from the ground and creating habitat piles. These will be left here but probably covered. The likelihood of them going to seed, of the, the pulled plants going to seed, is minimal. This is a pilot project, as I said. We'll come back next year to assess the results of this project. But we are very hopeful that in one or at most two years, we will have at least the potential of seriously controlling and maybe even eradicating Himalayan balsam from sections of our Irish rivers.